Okay, it's time for Geek Beat this morning. We're talking about ways to support local, stay healthy, and stay together all through tech. We've got Bert Lum and Ian Kitajima. They're joining us remotely. So, guys, what are we talking about guys? first? First, we're talking about, uh, about eating, right? About helping the restaurants as well. Yeah, so there's this really cool uh, program that was uh, sponsored by Central Pacific Bank Foundation. And what they did was they uh, encouraged people to go to restaurants and actually purchase uh, some food and take pictures of it and post it up on social media. So you can go to Facebook and Instagram, and Twitter. And they uh, encourage, of course, you have to um, actually hashtag it with uh, Keep Hawaii Cooking. And what happens is that um, if you do all the things that they instruct you to do, which is uh, pretty simple, I mean, just, you know, your typical sort of social media post, they will reimburse you 50% of your order. So, you know, I actually uh, took advantage of this. I went over to a restaurant called O Kim's, uh, which is right downtown over sure, here. And, sure, we've done uh, purchased there. a couple of, um, you know, good dinners. And, uh, you know, I posted it up on social media. You can you can go find it at, uh, at Bite Marks and... Um, you know, you send it in, you, you, you send in your receipt, and they will reimburse you. Right, and it had to be a certain, uh, uh, oh, it was the, the restaurants only came from a, from a list, though, right? They had to be like CPB clients or something. Yeah, so if you go to keephawaiicooking.com, you can find a list of all the restaurants that are participating in this. And uh, right now, they, are, they, meet, they met their $100,000 goal, which is what they wanted to support the restaurants with, but they are now... Uh, stretching their goal and they're going after 10,000 meals. So if you're out there and you want to order something, check out uh, keephawaiicooking.com and that will give you the list and the instructions on how to actually submit your social media post. All right. Thanks a lot, Bert. Now, Ian, what you got? What are you talking about this morning? Hey, guys. Hey, so, yeah, so, you know, your mom... Mom's always told us to wash our hands. So washing right. our hands are, is more important than ever. But some of us are not so good at it. But <laughs> we don't what? actually spend enough time washing our hands. So Mark Kimura at Oceanet uh, has put together uh, a little AI-powered sensor that actually will count how many people are were using the hand sanitizer at work or at, at your place of business. The other thing it will do is it will give you points. You're trying to get like 100 points. So whenever you uh, start washing your hands, this thing will actually give you points for for washing okay. your hands really well okay. so if okay you so get it's a point points, system for like washing your hands okay yeah for washing your hands exactly all right great now bert no bert you're talking about uh, different ways people are interacting with uh during this thing with regard to the internet and and kind of crowdsourcing kind of too right well so you know when uh we all got sort of uh sheltered in place everybody was looking at ways to communicate with their teams with their with their office mates and uh, everybody kind of jumped on zoom so i think everybody probably has multiple zoom conferences going on every day but uh there's something that uh, actually got released back in 2016 i i actually downloaded it i never used it but i i found out about house party and its renewed interest uh because house party Unlike Zoom, is more organic, it's more spontaneous, it's more uh, for your friends, right? And what you basically do is you, you load up a house party and you can invite sort of uh, spontaneously a friend to come in and do a video conference with you. And uh, Ian and I, we did that last night and it was, uh, it was pretty cool. And what, what is uh, interesting about um, house party is that, you know, it's been around for a while, but they recently got acquired by Epic Games, which is the same folks that own Fortnite. And they are introducing some games into the house party that you can actually play. So, you know, back, I guess, in February, they were getting like something like 130,000 downloads. But now in uh, now during the uh, shelter in place, uh, they're talking about two million downloads oh every day. Gosh. So it's really a, a popular app. And they, they limit you to about eight uh, you know, interactions right. uh, at, a, at, at a, a time. time. But at a time. it's again, it's kind of more of a fun thing. I mean, we're all, you know, caught up in Zoom, so, you know, right. house party is something to try. So Zoom and house party, the sign of the times. Mahalo to the geeks. Stay isolated, stay safe, and keep on dancing. Okay. We'll okay. be right back with Voice Sunrise. Don't go away. <laughs>